good afternoon to all of you good afternoon sir as in last lecture we have drawn the interfacing diagram of stepper motor that is interfacing of stepper motor with 8051 with the help of motor driver circuit that is ic uln 2003 or 2008 okay all of you drawn this diagram right now yes sir no. okay so today we will discuss related to some basics related to the stepper motor and then after that we will go with the uh, program for interfacing of stepper motor okay so stepper motor is a bl dc type of uh, dc motor that is brushless dc motor and it will rotate that is axis sorry axle of this motor will rotate in various steps the number of steps divided as per the angular displacement that is per step angular displacement so when we consider that a particular type of stepper motor will rotate with the 360 steps so per step it will rotate with the or uh, per step angular displacement is 1 degree so for completion of one rotation it will take 360 degree from 0 to 360 and if we consider it will be rotated with the help of uh, one step for 1 degree so in that case total 360 steps are required to complete the one rotation but as we if we reduce the number of steps in that case angular displacement is increase like if we reduce the number of steps that is uh, per step 2 degree then it will uh, reduces to the 180 okay and if we consider the generally or mostly used uh, 200 steps for one rotation in that case the stepper motor will rotate an angle of 1.8 degree for each step that is whenever we increment the digit by 1 for 200 steps in that case it will be incremented angular displacement by 1.8 degree and to interface this as it requires current more than the current supplied by the 8051 microcontroller so it requires some driver circuits that is motor driver ic or motor driver circuit so here we may use uln series uh for that purpose if we select the uln 2003 or uh, suppose uln 2008 so these are the uh, current booster circuit actually and it will provides the required current as per the requirement of an motor so it will not get the overburden to the controller's pin for driving the motors okay so in case of uh, stepper motor stepper motor will work or it will operates on the excitation of windings that is four windings are available suppose we consider the winding a b c and d so based on these windings and which winding is to be excited either one winding at a time either two winding at a time or alternate one or two so based on these three types are there so we will see afterwards see the first some basic steps uh, parameters related to the stepper motor or the words generally used in case of interfacing of stepper motor so step angle step angle is nothing but for each step the angular displacement is defined if uh, we required 2 degree if we required 1 degree if we required 10 degree so according to that you have to select your step angle with the help of number of steps so as the total angular displacement for one rotation is always 360 so after dividing it into the your requirement that is number of steps 10 steps 20 steps 50 steps 100 steps so simply divide 360 divided by that particular steps so you will be get the step angle okay and reverse case that is uh, steps per revolution 
if we go in the reverse order or reverse manner if your angle is fixed that is your uh, requirement is you have to rotate the axle of an stepper motor by 5 degree per step then simply number of steps will be calculated by 360 degrees divided by 5 degrees so whatever the uh, count is there value is there it will be your number of steps so uh, simply here we cannot go for fraction so you go with the uh, integer numbers so that your steps will be accurate and no further that is approximation that is rounding up so you select the step angle or number of steps Uh, step angle may be varies if we select the uh, number of steps that is 10 20 25 75 75 like this but uh, if we go with the uh, calculation of step with the help of your fixed angle in that case uh, mostly you prefer for the uh, count is integer not in uh, fractional numbers okay so that it will be easier for the calculation so this is related to the steps per revolution and step angle after that steps per second if we calculate uh, the number of steps completed that is 10 steps 20 steps whatever the uh, your requirement is there so according to that if we calculate the number of steps per second then we consider as steps per second so it will not generally uh, much important but last part that is rpm revolution per minute is most important if we consider uh to count the rpm of an stepper motor and if we want to execute your stepper motor as per your requirement that is revolutions per minute so it is uh, most important so according to that your step angle or number of steps may vary as per the your requirement so these are the terms generally used while using the stepper motors okay after that we go the types of revolution so here if we consider bipolar and unipolar two types of stepper motors are there generally we go with the unipolar stepper motors and here uh, three types are there wave drive full drive and half drive so based on the excitation of an winding of a stepper motor here types are uh, predefined so first type is wave drive in case of wave drive or all the driving modes four windings are there as stepper motor consists of total four windings and if we consider or nominated as winding a b c and d and as for here in the first column it is mentioned that steps steps are nothing but the complete steps but it will starts from first step step 1 step 2 step 3 step 4 and again it will repeat after the step 4 that is step 5 for this wave winding okay so here if we consider the excitation of only one winding at a time okay if we consider or if we excite only one winding at a time and remaining windings are at low level or low state reset it in that case we consider as a wave drive mode so uh, and for the next step we will excite the next winding and remaining windings again make it low again for next step third winding and last fourth step fourth winding we will excite and for that purpose if we excite a particular winding remaining winding should be at low level or low state and if we move further that is after one cycle that is after fourth step again we have to uh, make same sequence that is again you have to make winding a is high remaining windings are low again after that winding b after that winding c and after that winding d like this okay so in this case your excitation should be based on the uh, winding so in case of wave drive only one winding is excited at a time remaining windings are at low level you uh, you consider that c so in the table you see in that c this is the first winding a 
is high remaining are low after that b after that c after that d and after d again we will go for a after that again b c d and in continuous order okay so this is related to the wave drive so here power consumption is less as only one winding is excited at a time but generated torque is also less as only one winding is excited okay but if you want to increase the torque produced the torque by an motor so in that case you need to go with the simultaneous excitation of two windings so this can be done with the help of full drive mode or full drive mechanism so see in this case winding a and winding b so both windings are excited at the same time in a single step and remaining two windings are at low level after this again you go with the next two windings along with the last winding that is b is your last winding first is a second is b so again next step b will be continued as it is along with that next winding will be excited and first winding is uh, at uh, lower level or resetted so next step b and c will be excited third step c and d will be excited and in fourth step as d is the last winding so again we move towards the first winding so d and a so here not considering that a and d so d is the continuation c d after that d and again moving towards the first winding that is a so in this way continuously two windings are excited due to this power consumption is also high as compared to the wave drive but generated torque is also high so as per the requirement you may select either this mode wave drive mode or full drive mode and third mode that is half drive mode is a combination of these two modes okay so in case of half drive mode first we go with the only one winding excitation after that you go with the two winding excitation it is simultaneous that is mixing of these two so these four steps and these four steps if we insert in between uh, full drive steps are inserted in between the half drive step or, or half drive mode so total eight steps need to be carried out to execute the half drive mode we will see in the next slide c so in case of half drive alternately this is c winding a this is first winding is excited for the first step and remaining windings are at low level but in the next step two windings are excited along with first again next winding is excited but after that for next step only one winding is excited remaining windings are at low level again two windings after that one again two and sequence should be followed like this first and you have to follow first with next one again after that second only and then again next one okay so in this way alternate one and two windings are excited in case of half drive mode so in this way your angular rotation will be increased if we want to increase the rotation that is rpm increment so in this mechanism that is half drive mode we are able to increase your revolution like this and torque is also uh, maintained moderately not too much high or not very low so as this is a combination of these two power consumption is also moderate and torque is also at moderate level so these three modes are available for driving the stepper motor and as per your choice or your requirement whenever you required to interface and stepper motor with 8051 so as per the requirement you select any one mode which is feasible or applicable for you after that uh, code is there so if we consider this diagram so as we have discussed that uh, four windings are there this these are the four windings suppose a b c and d and here output of an driver ic so input is connected from controller side so output port of a controller is suppose here p2 is your output port and that too we are using uh, lower nibble that is p2.0 to p2.3 
so according to that as we have discussed in this table 0 1 1 0 whatever is there here so we consider just a b c and d so 1 0 0 so suppose here we considered that in one is a b c d so we should make here p 2.0 is one remaining r 0 0 like this and this out based on this similar output is generated here with the help of amplified version and it will be applied to the windings actual windings are here so here again a b c and d so supply and ground are also there so based on that you have to apply the signals as per your driving mechanism that is wave drive full drive or half drive okay so according to that uh, your axle of and stepper motor will rotate with the angular displacement okay see as we have seen that generally it will drives with the 200 steps and or we consider the degree angle is 1.8 degree if you want to change you may change no problem but generally we uh, consider on um, for most of the applications we go with the this combination 200 1.8 okay so uh, just take a note of this four points tomorrow at 12:30 i think 12:30 to 1:30 or 1:45 you you have a session of dr munir sayed sir and it will be conducted in the two batches okay so batch 3 as first two batches from a division and next two batches from b division tyb okay so batch 3 will be conducted tomorrow at 12:30 and if first batch that is uh, from roll number 1 to roll number 30 are engaged with the munir sir session in that case the remaining students will continue with the um, regular lecture or uh, practical whatever is there as per their time table so that faculty will be continued continuing your lecture that is as a revision lecture whatever is their lecture or practical and attendance will be considered by uh, considering both uh, munir sir session as well as for the subject lecture or practical so uh, as per the request from dr munir sir he want to discuss with you in person that is as uh, strength is more if we combine both divisions around 130s more than 100 students are participating no one will be able to talk or some some sometimes they may be hesitate how to talk what to talk or okay so here we are reducing the batch size for your betterment or your uh, understanding should be more so in that case your task or your function is whatever the session delivered by dr munir sir you should understood first if you have any queries doubts whatever comes in your mind at that time please ask to sir don't be like that only at the uh, simplex mode okay like only receiving whether he received or not sir is also not knowing and we are also not knowing so please uh, from tomorrow tomorrow first batch and uh, day after tomorrow second batch will be there so roll number 31 to uh, last 68 will be at fourth batch batch 4 so tomorrow 1230 batch 3 roll number 1 to roll number 30 will attend munisar session link will be provided to you and remaining candidates will join to the regular schedule as per the regular time table whatever session is there so teaching will be not done but 
revision should be taken okay and your attendance is mandatory for both monitor session as well as for uh, revision session okay so please attend the session with your participation not only listening more so if you have any queries ask whatever you want to discuss related to that topic you would discuss with the sir otherwise he will be uh, not entertaining us if you are not responding to him uh, the session should not be like uh, advisor session as advisor said that some faculty either me or in amdar sir ask somebody ask somebody so you better way you should uh, on your own ask some queries so that this situation uh, doesn't came while delivering the session and as reliance is coming towards us for hiring the student also that is at the be reliance jo some students are already placed in reliance jo from our last batch okay so if you people behaving like this then their interpretation regarding our students will be negative so it will be again hamper our uh, selection process also and this year you are not there but next year you will be there at the selection procedure that is you are in final year or next year so please ask the questions related questions okay well, whether it is uh, simple hard whatever how sir will answer your query or question it's sir's lookout but you should ask don't be at uh, sitting or uh, listening uh, like idle or whether you are listening or not we don't know so please try to understand and ask some queries it mean uh, it does not mean like that you are uh, listening completely and you don't have any queries related to that topic if market scenario uh, scenario if you want to discuss with sir how uh, job will come with the help of 5g technologies what will be the features now 4g is transforming into the 5g firstly from reliance side okay reliance jio okay they are working uh, since last 2 to 3 years on 5g also so based on that you may ask some doubts not for tomorrow's session after that again sir will take uh, two three sessions like tomorrow's sessions but if you participated wholeheartedly then and then he will uh, Uh, take the lectures otherwise he will not entertain us please it's my request to all of you that if you want to continue with reliance jio as a hiring partner for the college then you should participate with the sessions for session that is tomorrow as well as uh, day after tomorrow and hence for whatever the sessions will be conducted by dr munir sir okay so it's and request so please ask queries doubts related to the that particular topics which will be discussed during that session okay have you completed this yes sir okay write down this or it is not required for you step angle steps for revolution so like uh, these definitions will not be asked in the exam but these are the for your uh, understanding okay sometimes student may forgot that uh, what is rpm rpm is a word mostly used in industrial applications whenever motor comes either ac motor dc motor fan okay exhaust fan in that case rpm is used or while you are searching to purchase a motor single phase three phase 5 volt dc motor 24 volt dc motor 48 volt dc motor okay so in these uh, cases first and most important parameter is rpm and uh, of course for robotic applications so stepper motors are mostly used in robotics applications that is arm of an robot pick, pick and place assembly of an robot so where whenever and wherever uh, displacement angular displacement is required in robotic applications in that case or in this uh, uh, 
circuits stepper motor plays an important role because normal dc motor is there but its control is based on the supply of current and voltage so it will uh, not gives us precise reading that is if we want to rotate by and 10 degree only 12 degree only 17 degree only so it is not possible when we gives uh, apply the current it will jerk more as compared to the required uh, angular displacement in normal uh, dc motor uh, as we are using in uh, normal our robots which are be used for uh, robo race and other purposes okay if you have seen that or uh, some decorative purpose application some motors are there like ganpati's and diwali's decoration rotating wheels so there is no control of the angle so just rotates in clockwise or in anti clockwise direction but when we required a uh, particular or precise rotation with 10 degree 20 degree 30 degree like this so in that case you should go with the stepper motors only okay shall we move further no so we are writing this as per my calculation only 5 to 6 students are having problem of mobile and network but last 10 to 15 days your strength is going to be reducing and reducing up to the 42 45 as our strength is 68 okay and now 53 is a count along with my two id so 51 52 are there again 16 18 mm -hmm. students are absent daily two three students may be having some problems some functions we can understand but remaining candidates if you are under impression that whenever college will start we will attend lecture at that time mm -hmm. so don't do like this so from tomorrow onwards we will go for the next section that is section 2 pick microcontrollers so till now you are some familiar with 8051 that is either instruction set addressing modes programming interfacing either in assembly or in c but now for second section i think as per my Mm, assumption you are uh, not familiar with peak microcontrollers if you have any problem inform me accordingly in the morning or one day before tomorrow i am not able to attend the lectures due to this reason whatever reason is there try to attend all the lectures not just like that attending morning sessions only attending second lecture starting from second lecture some student may be having sleep with till 10 am like this so as we calling to the parents some parents telling that students are saying that today we don't have any lecture today is holiday for us so don't cheat yourself please try to attend all the lectures okay have you completed just one minute
कंप्लीटेड सर Okay, just go with the different driving modes. First is wave drive. So write the statement and table. After that, full drive.
completed sir yeah, hello have you completed both tables yes sir okay go for third one we have to take these values into the controller's output port whatever the combination of binary bits at lower nibal okay and higher nibal we will consider as a 00 0 and from this what will be the combination is there we are going to conduct or take the values according to these combinations either for wave drive full drive or hub drive mode completed sir okay so based on this status here the lower four bits suppose 100 is the combination for lower uh, hex values and again uh, one more digit is from higher nibal is 0 so 04 is there like this okay after that this c is there so 0 c so whatever the combination will be there and for this same also four like this whatever here sorry Here I think four. Here eight. Here two. Here one. Okay, or one, two, four, eight, like this. Okay. So we will go with the C 
program for this and also we will go for this as a experiment also that is interfacing of stepper motor with 8051 okay so if we consider the delay function if you want to use the delay function using timer you may go with this timer application okay but in the slide and for sake of simplicity i have taken this okay you may go with the delay and here it is not mentioned specifically to generate a delay of 10 second 20 millisecond 50 millisecond like this okay so if we go normally with the c function so c delay function that is my delay you have to go with the these two uh, loops okay this is for the delay actual delay whatever you want 1 2 10 so according to that here value will be automatically defined integer i time so here 10 1 is there and now here for 1 millisecond okay so according to that your delay function is similar in all respects for each and every program while interfacing so you just go if we go with the c programs then you go with this delay function no problem and here you mention only the number 10 millisecond 100 millisecond 50 millisecond so mention here 10 150 whatever okay so it will be generated according to the your number mentioned here or in the this here actual it is mentioned in this my delay 1 so 1 millisecond one time on, only repeated if it is 10 so it will be executing 10 times as i is less than 10 on decrement decrement like this okay so uh, so here only two functions are there one is delay and another one is main function as in main function we have seen in the diagram c only one port is used as output port and these port pins are interface with the driver circuits and output of that driver circuit is connected to the stepper motor so we need to work on these four pins only whatever signal you want to generate that is excitation of a b c or d alternately simultaneously to our mix combination that is half so according to that you have to write the values on this port only so we should go with this okay so p2 as we mentioned in diagram p2 01 lastly we will see in that 01 is mentioned so this zero is four zeros of higher nibble and this one is um, one calculated as a binary uh, from binary numbers hex value here one is hex value so 01 is a 8 bit combination so zero four zeros and one is triple zero one so as we have seen this is i think in here so 0001 so this is your suppose first winding okay so first one then two then four and then eight so this these are the lower nibble and higher nibbles we consider all four zeros so according to that eight bit hex value is calculated suppose one first give some delay after that next step that is two give some delay after that next step four give some delay and after that next step that is eight okay so in this way you are Uh, execution will be continuing as sake of simplicity or uh, understanding purpose if we go with incrementing values then it is easier to remember it that is 1 2 4 8 so wave drive mode so this combination is there okay here i have mentioned in comment so triple zero one so higher nibbles are zero zero if you want to mention so you mention zero zero no problem like this as we are not using these values so just consider as 0 0 or mention here no problem 0 0 okay so only this much related to the interfacing of stepper motor with 8051 but in hardware connection you have to interface the driver circuit with the motor or driver circuit in between controller and motor so that we are able to interface or drive the motor easily otherwise it will damage your controller's pin that is output pins whatever pins you are going to use okay he clear hai ka baga zara ke fakt asa samajnyasathi 1 2 4 8 getle nahi tar tumhi getana pahila a time ala vatte a winding la 8 4 2 ani 1 asa pan giu shakta okay 
आता याच्यामध्ये पण परत क्लॉकवाईज अँटी क्लॉकवाईज तुम्हाला जसं रोटेशन पाहिजे तसं आपण करू शकतो इफ यू वॉन्ट टू जनरेट ए डिले ऑफ टेन मिली सेकेंड और वन मिली सेकेंड युजिंग टायमर दॅट इज टी एच टी एल दॅट इज टायमर झिरो टायमर वन सो देन यू गो विथ धिस फंक्शन सो मेन्शन हिअर टी मॉड अँड दॅट स्टार्ट टायमर मेन्शन इनिशियल काउंट हिअर अँड देन ऑब्झर्व ओव्हरफ्लो फ्लॅग ओके अँड देन रिटर्न otherwise if it is not mentioned you simply go with this function no problem it will be easier for you for writing the function so when we go with this function it is easier so only you have to change here the value 1 10 100 500 like this okay so this function remains same if we go with the lcd then only mention here 20 millisecond okay for keypad also 20 millisecond no problem write down if you have any doubt please ask as this is experiment also huh? with this we have completed section 1 today i have scheduled one return test like we have conducted a earlier return test i think our lecture at 3 pm is on which day thursday na i think 3 pm 3 to 4 so on that day thursday we will conduct the test on this chapter that is unit 4 okay and during 3 to 4 pm you have to write down the questions along with the some answers and you have to attach the scan copies you have to attach scan copies within 4 pm to 4 15 pm so within 10 minutes to 15 minutes mostly consider maximum 15 minutes okay i will share you google uh, form and in that you have to upload your answers okay so for this purpose where is interfacing like lcd keypad and after that this adc dac and stepper motor i think these are the main points related to the interfacing so manje sagle interfacing che program na sir yes yes Do you have any e-copy of Mazdi book? E-book? No, sir. I will send you. Okay, Mazdi's e-book. Wide range of programs are uh, there available in Mazdi's book, so you may. refer to these uh, programs from must this book no problem i have i think one copy that is e ebook of must the i will share with you in syllabus last point is mentioned that interfacing of external memory so here block diagram that we have carried out in second chapter interfacing of ram rom and that to the 64 kb so explanation of that is required here also it is mentioned that how it is interface that is output enable pin read write like this pscn pins how they are important that is ale 
latch IC is there function. So in earlier that is uh, previous syllabus memory decoding technique is there that is interfacing of RAM, ROM with the different capacities that is 1 KB, 8 KB, 16 KB and questions are also asked but memory decoding techniques is not included in this. If it is included then uh, we will take but after that if time permits we will take it as a content beyond syllabus that is memory decoding techniques which is application oriented that is interfacing of 1 KB RAM interfacing of 4 KB ROM like this with the 8051. So in earlier syllabus it is there in syllabus itself but now it is not there. We will take you keep 3-4 pages or simply we will uh, take uh, later on as if you want to if you want to leave some pages, two to three pages, leave after this chapter. Otherwise, you take on separate pages also, no problem. So this can not be asked in your exam, but which will be helpful for selection of address lines, selection of data lines, how chip select line is important. But if you want to uh, take, then and then only I will take. Otherwise, it will some time consuming also, as well as maybe create some confusion also. Last syllabus la hai te, but the kai tasa sopa hai, interfacing diagram draw ke la tasa pakta address calculation and number of address lines required. Ke important task ka hai te ta, maje prior calculation hai thoda sa. Te pan asa kai calciver ke vagare java laag te asa kai nahi, hex values a hai. Te chan usar out of 16, Java line required ahe, 10, 9, 11. The same memory ji capacity as well. Just a 2 raised to upon 16 ke leki, 64 ke be upon interface kuru shok to. And 64 ke be interface as keli nai. Me fuck the 8 ke chis keli. Then monk be 16, just 16 address line ka seti operacha. Nai operacha. Me kai karna. Techanusa 2 raised to 9, 2 raised to 10. Kiti ate. त्याच्यानुसार आपण कॅल्क्युलेट करायचे की किती ऍड्रेस लाइन रिक्वायर्ड आहेत बेसिक मिनिमम 8 तर असतातच त्याच्या पुढचे जे आहेत त्या 2 3 जे असतील ते रिक्वायर्ड काढायचे आणि बाकीचे जे आहेत ते आपण वेगळीकडे यूज करू शकतो किंवा तुम्ही ग्राउंड करू शकतो लाइक दिस इफिशिएंट यूज ऑफ ऍड्रेसिंग लाइन्स ऑर ऍड्रेस लाइन्स लाइक दिस ओके वेव ड्रायव्हर प्रोग्राम लिहिला Hello. Yes, sir. Complete. Full drive. And Ashas Prakare, full sapan la. Honey, half sapan la. Full made fuck the values, but the laditha. Paki sagra same ahe. Half made pantasas as narita fuck the numbers just eighty. Full drive so, 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 Lecture some play declare Karacha Gudras Nigunda Chica has taken candidates la fifty two or forty seven. As an egg don't minta it over in the teen minted actually. Join Kartana late. Hi, sir. Hi, hi. Forty seven. Hi, hi. 
फोर्टी सेवन नहीं मटल मी हर्षल फनरल स्टेटमेंट के निगुन जाए गाय आते का लोकान तुम्हें आहत फोर्टी सेवन है ओके सर ओके इंटेन्शन का फिर तुम्हें गड़बड़ कर कारण आता जर समा गए कैंडिडेट मैं नहीं वाटत कि कैंडिडेट पर फूल ड्राइव ऐसी प्रोग्राम आज संध्या करते हाफ ड्राइव ऐसी करते नहीं करना है तो इतना दोन मिनट थे अवगड़ है दुसर लेक्चर तरीपन समझ लास्त एक्सटेन्ड कर अड़च लेक्चर है दोन पंच दोन पन्ना पर्यत घ नहीं करना मोस्टली स्टेपर मोटर है रोबोटिक एप्लिकेशन लूज होता जित प्रिज पाजे इलेक्ट्रिक बाइक वगैरह आल तला ही मोटर चाल नहीं कारण स्टेप बाय स्टेप चाल मग स्मूथ तुम्हारा एक फ्लो मिलना नहीं है इंजिन चाहते तस आता साध्या बी एल डीसी मोटर है नॉर्मल स्टेपर लगे फंक्शनिंग स्मूथली स्टेप बाय स्टेप ग्रीप मिलना नहीं है स्टेप नहीं जा चाल नहीं है सर्व मोटर वगैरह रोबोटिक आम लाध्या मोटर डीसी मोटर चाल नहीं अपन थोड़ा सप्लाय दे रोटेशन कर तर हाफ सा करू बाफ सा एट स्टेप्स लिखापन कैलक्युलेशन टेबल मध्य टेबल मधल कैलक्युलेशन तुम्हारा फिर इतना मेन्शन कर नर लिना तो जाऊ शक नो प्रॉब्लम यस बोला कुछ सब्जेक्ट ची पे जुलाई ची का ठीक है तुम्हारा आली ना एस एम एस का नहीं आला जस्ट मिनट एक मिनट होल्ड करा दाख तो लगे डीडीएच नाइनटी थ्री 
त्याच्यानंतर बिझनेस नाईन्टी सी आय पी एटी सिक्स आणि इनोव्हेशन आडवी सरांचं सेशन हंड्रेड सर ते सी आय पी आणि ते सी आय पीच्या अगोदर कुठलं नाईन्टी बिझनेस इथिक्स एक पण लेक्चर नाही सोडलं बिझनेस इथिक्सचा का बघा मॅडमला विचार तसं काही नाहीये त्यांच्याकडून कदाचित अपसेंटी लागली गेली असेल आणि सी आय पी पण केलेलं हो का लागू शकते एखादी त्यांच्याकडून मी दोन लेक्चर एकदा मध्ये हे केलेलं आहे ओमकार सूरज परत ते काय हे अजय कधी करतात कधी नाही आहेत दाबाडे अजय इंगळे दोन्ही प्रॉब्लेम प्रॉब्लेम म्हणून किती दिवस बसणार आहेत असं गोपाळ आहेत का आज होते का गोपाळ फोर्टी एट नाही ना काय चाललंय त्यांचं कळत नाहीये मला ठीक आहे असू दे पाटील सर ते गोपाळ चा काय प्रॉब्लेम आहे फोर्टी एट चा विचारा की जरा कारण मध्ये चांगले करत होते 